I don't care what they said. You are beautiful, you are sexy, and any guy would kill for a night alone with you. All right, Mom, I gotta bounce. Hey, say bye to Jonah. Oh, oh hey, absolutely. I just need the keys to the storm shelter. I like to call That's Jerry right. from somewhere private. Right. Our conversations can get a little NSFW. Uh, no. Hard to get in my car in this thing. But guess who's winning our costume contest? Oh, by the way, there will be no costume contest this year. What? Being newlywed sounds so fun. You must be doing it all the time. Uh-huh. All that sex and no baby. When's Jerry gonna put the bun in the uterus? Fair question. Your hand is like velvet. I sleep with gloves on. I think everyone would understand if you just went home. Trust me, when Sandra and Jerry come out in their Western garb, you're all going to look like fools. I look at these chumps. I see breakfast, lunch, dinner. Is your chair a little bit low? Is it? Yeah. Jerry, you didn't have to come. I told you to forget about it. I did, but then I remembered again. Hey, Jerry. Sandra told me you try to make her do stuff with men for money. What? OK, I, uh, I may have told Amy some family stuff that she. They're talking up. about me. Marilyn, I, I started sleeping with Shelly again. <laughs> what? Watching your brother work, huh? I heard you had a thing for him. Then we fold this. Wow! Get this guy into my bedroom. The storm shelter is just a great place to get things off your chest. Whenever I have troubles, I come down here and I shout them out. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Why did I have a baby so late in life? You know, stuff like that. It's mating season. Her gander must be worried sick. How do you know it's a she? The undercarriage, the neck. The feather loss on the back of her head where her mate pinned her down during penetration. Okay. Ooh, I didn't know we carried aged balsamic. Nice. Oh, yeah, that's great. I make a reduction and I drizzle it over vanilla ice cream. Oh, that sounds amazing. Are you like a culinary student or? Oh, <laughs> I've been a student of anything for a couple decades. Uh, you could have fooled me. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, this is Garrett. Dad? Oh, wow, okay. Hey, nice to meet you. Yeah. Garrett killed all my birds. Oh, uh, well. Then he had sex with me. Okay. Wow, busy guy. Okay, let's start by hearing everybody's work experience. You first, Justine. Oh, okay, well, um, I have worked here for over three years, and before that, I was a dog groomer, so I guess you could say I am good with hot-tempered bitches. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm very nervous. Good afternoon, ma'am. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> you have a uniquely high voice. <laughs> I didn't know that could happen after a stroke. Whoa, I can't go after that. That was so good. Diabetes stinks! I think I voted wrong! So your crisis of conscience at the Bachelorette? Totally fake. I wanted you all to let your guard down. I knew it, yes! But what are you doing now? Are you gonna kill Sandra's cat? Tina, she's not gonna kill the I'm gonna kill the cat. <laughs> oh, yes! Hi, it's me. Glenn wants us to adopt the 17-year-old and his shark. Feels kind of weird just going back to work, huh? Yeah, should we just call it? No, we can just think about Myrtle while we work. Great, now I gotta do two things. Meeting adjourned. Actually, I have an announcement. I haven't been able to find the right moment, but- Damn it, Sandra, meeting adjourned. Diane, why, why don't you come with me? Yeah, I guess, but I call dibs on any loose shrimp. Deal. I'll come too. Girls trip! No. Like, I get the concept of babies. I'm not even saying don't have babies. Like, have babies, but do I have to see the babies? Mateo, could you give me a hand? It's a dating thing, and you're the only person here in a functional relationship. Justine, I'm gonna stop you right there. Just because you send money to a man in Ghana does not make him your boyfriend. <sighs> relationship status? It's complicated. Oh, but this one has a timer. That's useful. Do you think that's more important than the self-cleaning feature? Well, I don't know, but I'm engaged to Jerry, and we're getting married, and I'm gonna wear a gorgeous white gown because I'm Jerry's bride, and I'm so happy, and I just need to tell someone. Oh, this one makes it right in a travel mug? Uh, yes, please. <laughs> oh, you don't have to be under oath for this. That's why I said, or whatever. Tita Uma. Ah, come on, stand up, Oh, that's right, you two are roommates. Mm -hmm. So I forgot to mention that Mateo is donating his liver to me. Because mine is completely destroyed. Give that vino to Mino. Justine, get out. Okay. I think I'm a 
Ellen DeGeneres dances too much. It's unprofessional. Oh, hey, uh, Colleen, right? Yeah, Colleen, the one whose locker you were just in? Oh, that's, oh, that's your locker. I thought it was mine. Oh, you're gonna head in there right now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, of course. Yes, I am. Yeah, your locker, go for it. Oh. Look. Everything is so hectic with this acquisition, and I need a floor supervisor, and you are the obvious choice. This is such an honor. Oh, God. I don't know where your nice flip-flops are, Bo. Just wear anything. Excuse me just one uh -huh. second. Cheyenne, you know we're not supposed to be on personal phone calls on the floor. Just one second. You can't just blow it off. You have to get here. Take a bath with the dogs later. My husband's being such a bee munch right now. What do you think they're gonna do with that information anyway? A lot. They can track what you do, what you like. They can scan your internet searches for keywords and then just send you ads for things you were talking about. That just seems thoughtful. Started. Stopped. So what if we leave Started. our phones outside the break Stopped. room? That way they won't know when we're in here. Started. A break without your phone? Do you Stopped. hear yourself? Jesus, Justine, either help Started. or keep quiet. Look, for what it's worth, when I left you that day, I was a different man than I am now. I was young and stupid, and I had this dream of selling belt buckle knives. And I made that dream come true. That was in there this whole time? But I can't forgive myself for leaving you for it. I watched this belt buckle go from prototype to market ready, but I didn't see you go from preteen to tall lady. There she is, there's our girl. Have you guys worked things out? We have, and we want to apologize. We were acting like such fools. Okay. So who do I listen to about the display? Me. Me. Dina? Hey, did you get the link I texted you? Uh, the link? Oh, yeah, 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 that was funny. Oh, what was it? it some rando emailed it to me. I was nervous it was a virus or something. Um, I, I'm trying to remember. You know, my brain is foggy. Amy need coffee, want caffeine. <laughs> I'm not sure what that was, but it is not banter ready. You <laughs> took over a wedding. This is the amiest thing I've ever seen. I don't want to be doing this. I'm just trying to make this the best day of their dumb lives. Tell me how to help. Now you want to help when we're almost done? Next time, figure out how to help on your own. I'm not going to help you help. You see? She's like a 12-year-old when I'm around. Oh, shut <laughs> up, Eric. I'm like this all the time, idiot. Oh, she's so mad. <laughs> this is my favorite. <laughs> Hey, Eric, stop. Come on, she's my boss. I was on fire. God, it's so good to be out there hustling. Oh, and we sell a sunscreen with glitter in it. Corona Cash is in it, music festivals. Two words, gay pride. Well, pride will be here before you know it, so let's stock you back up. It's a lot of boxes. Yeah, I had to borrow my stepdad's van to fit the rest. The rest? Yeah, so half of this is yours now, and once we sell all this, I'll break even and start making bank. Wait, so all that cash is not profit? I... Shannon, it's gonna be 10 years before we make money off this. What? 10 years? What am I supposed to do with money in my 30s? Check it out. I've already got my official ordination license from 5minuteminister.net. Oh, cool. Got your name and everything. Now, first, I need to get to know you better as a couple. So how would you describe your relationship? It's really nice. Right? Yeah. It's nice. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. But I guess this is your thing now, and it's not really up to me to make better choices. <gasps> Kelly! Hey, lady! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Hello! Oh, no. You two are wearing a couple's costume. Oh, I guess wow. it does, uh... Hi, I'm Mateo Liwanag, American influencer, philanthropist, and I'm truly honored to be serving the community by running a toy drive for a charity that's near and dear to my heart. River City Happy Tots. Tots? I mean, are we even allowed to call them that? I don't think the kids care. Oh, kids! <laughs> I thought you meant tots like little people. You can just edit that out, right? Oh, yeah, I didn't even press record this time. Jerry, what do you like about Sandra? She's great. Aw, she's not coming back, huh? Nope, guess this is dinner. Mm. Don't eat too much. I'll say that for a minute. Um, do you mind if I play a little harmonica to my practice? Yeah.
You're very talented. Thank you.